Now, if you would like to do multiple of those, what you need to do is go on um, to the logic again and go back to where we started. So here you see the selector for each three of these. So find out which one credits is. So we, I think it's the top one. And then basically do exactly what you did here. So top one into an AND gate with X and into a counter to make it on and then it should then make it bring forward a different menu and uh, you can have more options and stuff so I'm going to show you that now just in case and uh, you can try that so I, don't ha I haven't prepared for this one but um, oh sorry one thing I forgot to mention it hasn't glued look so I need to glue those to on and then move it back again there we go oh this isn't glued either yeah, make sure they're glued to the actual piece itself that it moves backwards and forwards okay so for the credits we'll just put something simple like I don't know me, my name Mr. spaces just to get it away okay so what you could do is copy one of these and remove all the logic from it like so put that on it so you can basically reuse it And this is the move forward backwards logic. We can you reuse this as well. Okay, so what we want to do is make these thicker material. And we can keep it white, doesn't really matter. Then we need to stick the text there. Okay, so for now, let's go on front view, line it up, move it back to the back. Okay, now highlight which one credits is, just so we know, so it's this one. Then we get an AND gate, so it's going to start to lag a bit now, and attach that to there. Then we get the X button and attach it to the other one. And a one shot gate. We then also need to make a new circle back. So get the circle into here. The out goes into here activated by that. This will move forward so that plugs into there like that. So let's have that. Okay one last thing um, this one we want it to appear to be pitch black while nothing is connected, uh, so well it's not selected sorry like so so this is what the player sees at the minute so if I go on options it brings that we can choose credits it brings Mr. Malvaro forward so if it goes back the camera goes a bit weird because of the position of it, it's behind this there we go. oh wait now I've hooked it up, my bad get rid of that, don't want that Oh, as you can see, and options. You can add sound effects you like, if you like. Um, I'll just quickly show you an example. 
So up and down could have a sound effect, left and right could have a sound effect, I'm pretty sure you can figure that out. Now for the main part I wanted to show, hide away the other bits, so get a big block and make it 100% here, sorry, 0% there, and make it bigger, like so, put it all the way to the back and bring it forward one, like that, and then press circle, and this is what the players see. So then they can go, um, sorry, options, and it will go forward. Now go back, credits. Ah, sorry, the one thing we've got to do is disable the menu once slightly selected. So let's get to that now. So remove that screen if you want. I, I'll just remove it for the purpose of the tutorial. Okay, so credits, when that is on. We need to get an OR gate, so, so OR, this goes in here, this isn't going to work, but I have to do it like this first to make me understand. <laughs> okay, so none of those are selected, meaning it should be on. So what we could do is have it, sorry let me figure this out, so I have credit selected, yeah that's what I want, so I need an OR gate that goes from this one and this one, like so. And make that inverted like so I just see the text has gone off um, <laughs> to fix that uh, Sorry, what, where's this wired up? So, ah, yeah, there, it's gone off. Okay, uh, what we want is for this to go into it. Like that. Options. Credits. And if you would wish to add another option, which is basically do exactly what I did here, or here, and then add one more here, and shove that in there. Now, I know that's a pretty big tutorial, um, hopefully you got everything, uh, if not, then I will be exporting this to my XMB, which basically means it will make it into a save file, and then I should be able to share it with you guys. Um, if if possible, the link is in the description. If it's not possible, then I apologise for false hope. But hopefully that was helpful to you, and hopefully um, you enjoyed that. And I will see you in the next tutorial. I'm Mr. Mauro. Goodbye.